Hello. 116 up, 116 up first with 321 on deck. Sean Whelan from RT News. Hi, Sean. Hi, Killian. Um, Kogardigas, Agus Mahu. Congratulations <laughs> and well done. Um, folks back home in Ireland are waking up to this brilliant news and they're sharing um, your success. They're absolutely, absolutely delighted for you. But they want to know how you are feeling holding that lovely statuette in your hands now. Please tell us and please don't hold back because we love emotion in Ireland. <laughs> Um, it's, a, it's a little bit of, I'm a little bit of a daze, you know, I'm very overwhelmed, uh, uh, I'm very humbled, uh, I'm very grateful, and, uh, you know, very proud to be, to be Irish standing here today. Next question from number 321 and 236 on deck. Hi Killian. Hi, yeah. Silva, Arise Play, Nigeria. Your career thus far is chapter and verse when it comes to variety and range. But let's say in the fullness of time, if people remember you or commemorate you or even choose to define you yeah. by Oppenheimer, would you be content with that? Very content. <laughs> I mean, you know, you gotta move forward, but this has been a huge, huge moment for me. The movie is so special to me and, you know, myself and Chris have such a special relationship. But, I just feel very privileged to be to be continue to work with him, and I'm very proud that you know that this is a film that is provocative and that asks questions and is challenging. But yet, you know, it, it, so many people want to see it, uh, so I'm really really proud of that. Final question from number two thirty six in the middle. Hi, Jillian. I'm Alex I'm, Welcher. They framed. Congratulations. Thank you. I just wanted to ask, how does it feel to not only reach this point in your career, but to do it side by side with Chris, who has emerged as one of the most important collaborators of your career. It's very, very special. You know, I, I, it's, we've been working together for 20 years. I think he's the perfect director. He's an extraordinary writer. He, he's an extraordinary producer. He's extraordinary visually, extraordinary director of actors. He presents his film like no one else does in, in the world. Uh, and I just can't believe my look. You know, I did a screen test for him when I was a kid, and I thought that would be it. And it would be just enough to be in a room with Chris for a couple of hours, and here we are. So I'm, I'm just so humbled and thankful. Apologies, we have one final question. It's virtual, if you can look at the camera. Oh, I see, From okay. News Talk Irish Radio. Oh, Henry I see, Sarah. okay. Oh, hi, Killian. Ah. It's Henry McKean here. Uh, from News Talk Radio Ireland, coming from a pool top bar, celebrating you. Congratulations. Good for you. Uh, <laughs> I, just want, I just wanted to ask you, um, are you going to sing a rebel song? And how does it feel to be the first uh, Irish-born man to win Best Actor? Well, um, it, it's, it's really, really meaningful to me and uh, I don't know if I said this in my speech because I can't remember what I said, but um, I did. I did want to say, you know, that I uh, uh, that I think in Ireland, you know, we're really great at supporting artists, and I think we need to co to continue to support artists and the next generation of actor and director. I think that's vitally important. Um, that's all I have to say, really. Congratulations! Thank you so much.